Easter flavor, but and it's early in the season, so we can handle all that. We'd like to see some rain, but this kind of tells us, or telegraphs, uh-uh, not happening. I know, by that point, we're in April, and what are yeah. the chances? So yeah. I'm glad we're getting some rain tonight. Oh, yes, please. Bring it on. Bring it on. Let glad me... you were with us. It was good to, good to report this, too. <laughs> and glad you were with us tonight. Thank you for joining us here during Cron for News and Crime. Sports Night Live is next. Don't go anywhere. We know this is an uncertain time. We know you're concerned about tensions abroad and the strain at home. You have questions. News Nation promises to help you find the answers. Wake up with Morning in America. It is nice to have something uplifting to share with you today, especially in light of all of the news going on. The team you can trust to keep you informed and engaged. Our Robert Sherman is live in Ukraine this morning with the very latest for us. Everything you need to know to start your day a little brighter. Morning in America, weekday mornings at 7, 6 central on News Nation. Welcome to another edition of Sports Night Live. I'm Jason Dumas. This is Kylan Mills. Kylan, between the NCAA tournament coming to town, the Sanford women out in Spokane, and the Warriors traveling up the eastern seaboard, we've got a lot to chop it up about. Yeah, Jason, a lot of hoops action. I am living for the NCAA tournament games this weekend. They have been giving me life. So much excitement. I was cheering on the St. Peter's Peacocks. I don't know about you. I was, I was really too. hoping to see history made them go to the Final Four. A little disappointing there, but not quite as disappointing as the Warriors play lately. My goodness, it's been rough for Golden State fans. It really, really has. And you know what? If scroll up a little bit, the Warriors are struggling to form an identity right now, which is kind of concerning, given the fact that we're just two weeks out of the playoffs. Yeah. Some of it is because of injuries. we got to give him that. Clay comes back, Draymond gets hurt. Draymond comes back, Steph gets hurt. There's just no continuity, but there also has to be some accountability over on Warriors' way where they're headquartered because Steph isn't going to fix everything. He just won't. There's too many holes right now. The Dubs were in our nation's capital today taking on the Wizards, and they've already lost to the Magic.